An early morning home burglary in Rockford turns into an ongoing investigation for police. When they arrived in the 1800 block of Auburn, they found more than just evidence of a break-in. WTVO Channel 17's Jewel Hillary has more. More than 100 firearms were removed from this home on Auburn Street. It's a scene residents say they aren't accustomed to. I'm getting my paper and I'm, I'm thinking it's an accident or something, but I look over and I see them with all them rifles. It's just unreal to see this many guns involved in a regular residential neighborhood. Police were called to this home just after 2 this morning. They arrived after neighbors called about a burglary. When police got inside the home, they found empty shell casings and a variety of weapons from shotguns to rifles. Some were loaded, some weren't. Some don't appear to be applicable because they're old. Um, and then some appear to be fairly new. Police say a 67-year-old man owns the home and the weapons. He is a legally registered gun owner. And at the current time, we're taking the firearms for safekeeping as evidence until we can further investigate this and speak to the resident. Neighbors say even though the weapons may be legal, it still poses a security threat to their neighborhood. Even if he a uh, registered gun owner or not, that just seemed like that's too many rifles. Shortly after police arrived, the home was condemned and the guns were only a part of it. When the police got to this residence, they found a tremendous amount of garbage and different items stacked from the floor to the ceiling throughout this residence indicative of a hoarder. Police will run checks on all of the weapons to see if any were stolen or involved in crimes. In Rockford, Jewel Hillary, WTVO Channel 17 News. As of late this afternoon, police haven't charged the homeowner. Police say he's out of town and they're still trying to get in contact with him. Police have also not made any arrests in the burglary.